show hosts play Scrabble. And one of them is an eight-letter word. The clue is he's been known to press his luck. It's the crossword game you've played all your life, but never quite like this. And here's your host, Chuck Flurry. Uh, thank you, Charlie Tuna. And I'd like to welcome everybody to Scrabble. We've got a special week going on this week. We've had more fun, had a great time. Some of your favorite hosts are here to play with us this week, and Charlie's going to introduce two of them to you right now. John's a proud daddy, and so is Jamie. The host of Hollywood Squares, John Davidson. And the host of Double Up, Jamie Farr. <laughs> oh, this is great. Did you notice how Ashley, John, Marie, Ashley Marie has my nose? Do you understand John, that? John, you, you notice I how I have say. Dave's nose? <laughs> John looks, uh, she looks a lot like you, John. I hope she's my good luck charm. And she wants to talk into the mic. I have not won a game yet this week, and yeah. Ashley Marie is going to be my good luck charm. What a cutie. You Gosh, she is. How about Ashley Marie there all during? No, my wife Rhonda is here. I'm going to put her off stage. I how about going to say, me too, because we don't have enough newspapers for both of these. <laughs> this is a baby also. I'll be right back. Yeah. All right. Hey, you're, you're, let Dave yours go. looks just like you, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know that. Kind of... We both have fleas. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go on, Dave. Go get him, Dave. Come on, Dave. Uh, Dave will find go a place Dave. over there. My dog, Dave. That is your dog, Dave. <laughs> I know. Now, listen, Dave. here's what we did. We asked our viewers to send in postcards, and uh, names were drawn at random by NBC Compliance and Practices. Now, they've kept these names secret, and each of you uh, has an envelope in front of you. You guys going to open those a little bit later and find out who won, okay? Whichever wins, that's who it's going to go to. Right at home there, okay. Take a look. We're going to play Scrabble. Who won the toss backstage? Uh, I forgot. I think you did. I think I did. Okay, yes, John did. We're going to play Scrabble until somebody gets three words right. That player goes on to our Scrabble sprint. And a chance the bonus worth $10,000. Take a look at the board as we set up for our first game. We're building on the letter A, eight letters in the word. And the clue is some guys have... An old, useless one hanging around. Wait, wait, read it clearly, Chuck. Come on, Chuck. There's a lot at stake here. Oh, no. You're just le oh. lucky Rafferty is in here. Some guys have an old, useless one hanging around. Useless. <laughs> when you think you know yeah, the word, a lot of help, hit yeah. your buzzer and Did don't forget the pink and blue. you say some old guy? Some old guy or just sunny guy? No, just some guys some have guy. an old, uh, useless old guy, one I would, hanging yeah, around. If you're through fooling around, Chuck, well, I'll I'm take doing the, the best ten. I can. <laughs> and I will take the nine. A... And an L. I'd like the L, please, Chuck. $500, John. Ooh. Think about this now. Some guys have an old, useless one hanging around. Uh, uh, I'll use the other A. You have Chuck. one. Yes, I'd like it. Some guys have an old, useless one hanging around. Uh, hanging around. Hanging, hanging. Uh, no. Uh, I'll take the eight and the seven. I'm going right down the list here. A C. And a D. D is for Davidson and good luck. I'll use the D. Hit it. Some guys have an old useless one hanging around. John. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'll try, try the C. C, Chuck. John, some, some guys have an old useless one oh, hanging please, around. Uh, can I do that? Odd calendar. That's right. It's calendar. Yes. That's one. One. I got okay, one. Jamie. Back to the board. Here we go. Building on the letter E in calendar, six letters in the word, and the clue is kids sometimes take one in the bathtub. Jamie? Kids sometimes take one in the bathtub. Well, I know John knows this, <laughs> so I better take some pile here okay. and get Three. some letters because I'm going to need lots of help. F here. and an L. Which would you like to try? Uh, let me try the L. Nope, let's stop. It's over to you, John. Kids sometimes take one in the bathtub. Uh, I will choose the letter. I'll take eight. F and an I. Can I try this without choosing either one of those no, two stuffers? No, you must take one of the letters. Must take one of the stuffers. <laughs> yes. Uh, I'll try uh, the F. That's a stuffer. Oh, good. See, you, I, oh, this is great. I thought I was right. I just yes. didn't know the spelling and, of it. This you, is and, wonderful. Well, well, oh, oh, good. This is great. only one stopper yeah. left. I'll Jamie, go for it. Try to get right. some money. All right, I don't care. I'm. I've got this. Now. D and an I. Yes, I'll take the D. Well, of course you will. And I'll take the I. Good. Take two more that? tiles. And I'll take two more tiles. I don't even have to look at the word. What do you think of that? What were the tiles? I don't even care. I'm going to give you the word. What do you think of that? you got to use one of the tiles. I'll use one of the tiles. Use one of the letters. I'll use the U. What do you think of that? 
What do you think of that? Tell me what it I'm, is. Yeah, it's Ducky. That's right, it I is Ducky. I knew it all along. <laughs> I thought it was I was dumb. hoping you'd hit that C. That was with a Y. Yeah. That was so See, you had that I. All I you had to do was take the I. I should get it. the baby questions. You had the yeah, dog. I know. Well, here we go. Back the dog. Dog. Well, we haven't got time. All right, we're going to be in speed word. You all know the rules. Hands on your buzzers. Yes. Don't answer till I say go now. All right, here we go. Building on the letter K and Ducky, eight letters in the word. The clue is it can be a ball and chain. It can be a ball and chain. Ready? Necklace. Oh, I knew that too. He got it Excuse right. Excuse me. It may not be right, and you can't answer till I say go. It can be a ball and chain. Ready? Go. Jamie. Jamie. I got it. Necklace. Right. Necklace. I said it first before. I said it first. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. But you I, can't. I, the first thing I said, John, was you can't answer till I say go. Oh, I minute. wasn't listening to you. Wait a minute. Let's be fair. I'm right. going to give you the word and play you even. How's that? Give him that. Maybe you can't do that. Maybe the show won't let you. <laughs> give it to him. Give it to give him it and to I'll him. play him even. John's now too. Now you can't do Wait, that. You're I not, don't do that. I That's don't want I pity okay, anyway. Let's go. It makes me look like a great guy. <laughs> let's go on, you guys. Billy, you know what I feel like. Necklace, six letters in the word. The clue is it's the latest in news reporting. Ready? Go. If you want to give him the word, don't answer. Got it. Tell me. Update. That's right. It's the latest news report. It's all tied up. Here we go. Building on the letter U and update. Seven letters in the word. And the clue is some people do business over it. Some people do business over it. This is for the game. Ready? Go. Some people do business over it. Jamie. Counter. Counter is exactly right. Got gotcha. you. You are doing so well, John. You really were. She I never win. We got a code of phone. This person didn't go away empty-handed. Well, who's you want to know who it is? Yeah. This person is so lucky to have me as And uh, the her first time you partner. won 1500 bucks, that's most than anybody's. Most Joseph Chrisloff, Jr. of Middleport, Pennsylvania. Yes. All right. Code of phone for them. We'll see John later. And Jamie, if you'll come down and join me. He's got his envelope. He's got 500 for that. Ooh. He was. One, two, three, four. Five hundred dollars, and we're gonna come back just at this <laughs> And now back to Scrabble and Chuck Worry. All right, I have the very capable Mark Summers standing next to me here. He uh, hosts Double Dare on uh, Nickelodeon, as a matter of fact, and he does very well. And he's gonna take my place, and he can do it. Thank Good luck, you, Chuck. Good luck to you as well. Okay, Jamie just won one thousand dollars in our crossword, and you're about to establish a sprint time for our home viewer. Why don't we find out who that home viewer is, Jamie? All right, love to Mark. Uh, Hilda Grubb from Bloomington, Indiana. All right, near my hometown of Indianapolis. Okay, you're going to establish a time, Jamie. The winner of the next crossword will come up here and try to beat that time. Remember, it's four words. Got to hit that plunger. All these letters are good. There are no stoppers. Here we go. First word has five letters. A watermark. A watermark. Ready? Okay. Go. T. -A -T. Yes, Spitz. Very good. The Spitz is amazing. 1.8 seconds, second word. Six letters in the word. They have their ups and downs. They have their ups and downs. Ready? Yes, go. go. T. They have their ups and downs. S. They have their ups and downs. K. C. They have their Stocks. ups. Stocks. Yay, way to go. No, I got it. <laughs> 9.4 seconds, terrific time. Moving on to our third word. Eight letters in the word. It can go to your head. It can go to your head. Ready? Yes. Go. B. It can go to your head. M. O. It can go to your head. O. I. E. R. It can go to your head. Yes. Uh, oh, sombrero. Oh, 10 second penalty. All right. You uh, have to say the word uh, within the time limit, so yeah. let's start the clock again. Is it ready? I, okay, it's, you can't use I foreign can't, words. I can't okay. tell you yeah. anything more than all that. All right, all right. Ready? Yeah. Go. It can go to your head. Uh, oh. It can go yeah. to your head. Sombrero. That's right. Yeah, I didn't know. Okay. All right. Still a good time. 32.7 seconds. Last word. Nine letters in the word. Sometimes they're screaming. Sometimes they're screaming. Ready? Yes. Go. E. Sometimes they're screaming. D. L. Sometimes they're screaming. A. I. Sometimes they're screaming. 
Headlines. Headlines is right. Okay, 43.1 seconds. Could be a good time. We're going to come back and see how Chuck Willary does right after this break. Welcome back to Scrabble. Jamie Paul, you've won $1,000 so far for Hilda Grubb in Bloomington, Indiana. And uh, we're going to see you in just a little bit. All right. Thanks thank you. Good here. luck to you. Thank you. Peter is terrible. Chuck is great. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's meet the two new hosts, Charlie. Peter started out in the mailroom of a major studio. Chuck was once a wine cellar. The host of Press Your Luck, Peter Tamarkin. And the host of Scrabble, Chuck Woolery. <laughs> okay. I want to know about the wine cellar. How many could they store? We'll get into that in a second. Actually, a cellar. I just I, I he wasn't a huge it. cellar. He was a yeah, sold wine, Peter. Yeah, he didn't open me up and have a drink. <laughs> Where did you start off? Uh, oh, studio, I. Peter? They're talking to me over here. You're the Sorry. champ. That's right. Sorry. What studio were you in the mailroom? Uh, Fox, 20th Century Fox. I just, in fact, got a call from them yesterday offering me the same position. <laughs> okay, well, good luck. <laughs> All right. And uh, how long did you sell wine, Chuck? I sold wine for about uh, a year. Was it fun? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, who won the toss backstage? I Chuck. guess I did again. Yeah, you yeah, did. I did. Okay. Well, let's get started. Let's go to the board. We're going to be building on the letter O, nine letters in the word. The clue is where you hear about babies, cookies, honey, and sugar. Where you hear about babies, cookies, honey, and sugar. That's it. Well, I, I don't know. I'm like Karnak. Really? Take a couple of tiles. <laughs> One and four. Have an L and a Y. Try where the you y. hear about babies, cookies, honey, and sugar. Let me try the L. Where you hear about babies, cookies, honey, and sugar. All right, worth $500 if you can tell me the answer, Chuck. Where you hear about babies, cookies, honey, and sugar. That can't be right. Take a guess? No. All right, two more tiles. No, I can't be right. Six and a nine. Have an O and a W where you hear about babies, cookies, honey, and sugar. Well, let me try the O. Yes. I think the W is a stopper, but I don't know whether this is right. It's not lollipop, is it? No, lollipop is incorrect. Goes over to you, Peter. Hollywood. Hollywood. All right, you got oh, it. We got in there yes. somewhere. Hollywood is the answer. Lollipop. All right. <laughs> you got one in there. I didn't got my sounds in mixed up there. In there. <laughs> All right, one for you, Peter. Nothing for you, just Chuck. Thank but, you so uh, we'll much. We'll move on to that. We're building on the letter D in Hollywood. Five letters in the word. The clue is the style to which Queen Elizabeth has become accustomed. The style to which Queen Elizabeth has become accustomed. Well, gee, I don't know. Two and a five. A W and an H. Try the H. <laughs> Stopper goes over to you, Peter. <laughs> All right, I pick a tile then, right? You do yes. pick a tile. I do pick. I have to ask you. Do He's the host, Chuck. No, I forget. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't. Seven. All right, we have a W and we have a D now. I hope the W. The style to which work. Queen Elizabeth I'm has become I'm going to try the W <laughs> just in spite of you. Okay. Give me the W. Uh, oh, oh great. Oh. Style to which Queen Elizabeth has become accustomed. Well, I don't want to say this, but... Yes. Dowdy? You are right. Oh, oh no! Oh. oh! Oh! All right. I that want my sounds, mommy. That means that we're out of time in this game, and we're going to have to play the rest of it in speed word. Put your hands on your buzzers. We'll Very put the letters in place one at a time. Okay, I'm going to back up. Can I give you the last letter, gentlemen? <laughs> Building on the letter O in Dowdy, eight letters in the word. The clue is... Some people are moved to do it. Some people are moved to do it. Ready? Go. Some people are moved to do it. Chuck. Relocate. Very good. That is the answer. Coming back. $500. All right. You got oh, it. I got money. 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 That's Ooh, one, like. two, three, four, Ooh, five. This is good. That's good. good. Money there for the person you're playing at home. Now we're building on the letter R and relocate. Six letters in the word. The clue is, he was always right. He was always right. Ready? Go. He was always right. <gasps> he was always... Peter. Peter. Wil Wilbur. Oh. Wilbur is oh. the answer and you have the game. Oh. <laughs> Congratulations, Peter and Chuck. You have won $500 in bonus money for I your have home indeed. player, plus a terrific coat of phone. And why don't you open up your envelope, and we'll find out who that is. And I lost to a good boy. What a guy. That's That's it. It. Yeah, my that was to terrific. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Uh, Mrs. Jacqueline uh, Mikovlik. Mikovic. Mikovic. And she's from Baltimore, Maryland, and uh, got $500 and a coat of phone. And a coat of phone, nice which thing. is not bad. So, You'll be uh, back in just a few moments. Peter, come on down here and bring your envelope with you. You have $500 so far, going for more money. 
And we're going to be right back to play Scrabble Sprint right after this. Yeah. Yeah, you're wrong. Back to Scrabble and today's loser, Chuck Willery. The nice thing about it is I lose the game, but I get my job back. So you know. this is real acting now, trying to be nice to this guy. Well, he won. You. He was good. He did very well. Jamie Farr is playing for Hilda Grubb, and he has a thousand dollars for her so far. He's established a time of forty-three point one. I think he wears his dresses, doesn't he? I don't know. Forty-three point one. This may be a shoe in. You never know. Peter Tamarkin has five hundred dollars. They're playing for a thousand now, and the chance to play for that ten thousand bonus, which Jamie, I might mention, has already won once. And uh, but who are you going to play for? Well, we're gonna, uh, this is actually, we're playing for charity. No, we're not. Come well, on, says, who is this? It's Bill Rafferty. No, yeah, I see that. Well, that is charity. <laughs> Janie Al Britton from Aurora, Colorado. Very good, yes. Ski country. Very good. Okay. Okay. we will be playing for Janie. Same four words. Remind you to hit your plunger. That's what stops the clock. No gotcha. stoppers in any of these words. Right. Boy, am I going to screw you up. <laughs> <laughs> I love the channel. First word, five letters. A watermark. A watermark. Ready? Go. T. P. The watermark. Yes. Uh, say it. Bot. Oh, no, no. Ten second penalty. Ten second. Let's continue. Let's continue, though. You haven't got the last letter yet, so let's continue. No, no, no. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's all right. See, going crazy over there. I'm going to slap. I'll, I don't usually hit women, but I'll hit him. Let's go on. Let's continue. A watermark. Ready? Yeah. Go. Ah. Uh. Bits. Yes. Okay. That's what I said, but you didn't understand. It didn't cost you that much. It didn't cost you that much. It's all right. Uh, six letters for the next word. They have their ups and downs. Ready? Yeah, ups and downs. Okay. Go. S. T. K. They have their ups and downs. C. Stocks. Yes. The third word. You still have 20.3 seconds. The third word, eight letters. It can go to your head. It can go to your head. <laughs> Almost Ready? did. It took a while. It takes a while to get up there. Wake up. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Go. B. S. No, no, no. No. O. I make up letters. Uh, S. It can go to your head. Uh, e. Uh, Quickly. Sobriety. Oh, no. No. I can hurt. I got all upset. Wait. Don't click on me, Chuck. Wait a minute. I'm out of work. <laughs> Chuck. Well, we're still not finished. You have a 1.4 seconds. Oh, away. I know what it is, too. Well, tell me. Sombrero. That's right. Okay, right. now. I knew that. Now, you have 1.4 seconds left for this last word. So you have to get, you're probably going to have to get it right off the clue. No sweat, 4. Chuck. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing to me? Nine letters. Sometimes they're screaming. I don't want to encourage you, but you'll never get it. <laughs> Thank you, Chuck. I'm going to deck you, too. <laughs> Are you ready? So, what is it again? You'll, you'll never get... No, pardon me. You'll so, never get this. Sometimes they're screaming. Sometimes they are screaming. Yes. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Go. L. Congratulations, <laughs> Jamie. <laughs> uh, screaming me, me, me. Headline. 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 Yeah. Headline. Yeah. 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 Well, still, you won how much? Five hundred dollars for Jane Britton? Not bad. No, that's not bad. She's not great. <laughs> Jamie Farr is going to come back for the ten thousand. Uh, Hilda Grubb has two thousand dollars. We'll be back to see if we can win it right after this. Oh, you got. And now back to today's winner, Jamie Farr. The incredible Jamie Farr. Two thousand dollars he's made for Hilda Grubb already, so she ought to really be happy. You got a chance to make ten thousand for her now. Love to do that. You've done this once already. You can so do it. So have you. We're the only two that seem to do this. Well, right? maybe this uh, is magic. Let's see yeah. if you can do it again. Okay, ten seconds on the clock. Two words. All right. Okay, you can do this. Ready? Yes. Six letters. Humpbacks. Hump. Backs. Ready? Yes. Go. M. Camels. Yes! Very good! Very good! I was afraid you were going to think of whales and all that kind of stuff. No, if Rafferty good. were here, he would have said dromedary. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Very good. You've got 9.5 seconds. Now, without really joking around, yes. this is a lot of money for her. Uh, 9.5 seconds. Uh, plenty of time. Okay. okay. Seven letters. He's the voice of experience. 
He's the voice of experience. All Ready? Right. Yes. Go. A. D. He's the voice of experience. R. N. He's the voice of experience. T. Uh, oh. Veteran. Yeah, you're right. Boy, oh, you just I got it. it. Oh, you I'm just sorry. Yeah. It. No, you just missed. Once it's I down keep to triple doing zero. That, Boy, I? that was so close. Sorry, Hilda. You, if you'd have gotten that T, you'd have yeah. been closer and gotten vet. That would have done it for you. Well, uh, Hilda, you got two thousand dollars, even though you didn't get the ten thousand. So, well, thanks for chunning. <laughs> we'll see. They're coming at it, Chuck. They're coming at it. Some members of our studio audience and some home viewer participants will receive Kodafone's 3530 electronic bulletin board answering device, an 8410 feature phone with automatic dialing of up to 32 pre-programmed numbers, furnished by Kodafone. And now, professional salon nails you can do at home. New Lee Sculptured Nails. Quick, easy, permanent-like salon nails. New Lee Sculptured Nails. Plus, Hoover's cordless wet and dry handbag. Picks up both wet and dry spills and is easy to clean. Hoover keeps making it better. And new Scratch Guard bath and kitchen cleaner. Scratch Guard cleans and shines household services without scratching. New from Turtle Wax. Plus, whenever you get snack hungry, Little Debbie has a snack for you. Delicious, individually wrapped and economical. Available in multi-packs. Also convenient single packs. At Ambush, the fragrance wraps a woman in a sparkling aura. Ambush by Dana. Very very special fragrance. Plus, new Jolly Time microwave popcorn gives you 30% more popcorn than before. And the improved larger bag pops in all microwaves. Enjoy the great taste of Jolly Time popcorn tonight. Due to technical errors, the celebrity's tile selection and a home viewer reveal were recreated, a sprit round replaced, and the program edited. Chuck Willery's wardrobe furnished by Pierre Cardin. Scrabble, starring Chuck Willery, is produced in association with Exposure Unlimited. This program is based on the Scrabble brand crossword game. This is Charlie Tuna speaking.